What's up, everyone? Mark Lobon and TigerFitness.com. <sighs> Get a lot of emails. Too many damn emails, and I've been responding to every single one of them, but it doesn't appear to be stopping. Does it stop? What I'm going to do? I'm going to answer it right here. I'm going to set the record straight. Straight. Straight like a BBC. Straight. Check it out. Meal timing. Meal frequency. 15 emails just now. And I have 10 more left on the subject in my email box. I kid you not. My box is stuffed. That sounded wrong. Okay. I like intermittent fasting. I like people who eat frequently. I like people who eat in the middle of the night. You know why? It doesn't matter. I'm going to set it straight. I'm going to go on the record. I'm going to eat right now. Mm. I'm going to set it straight. As long as your calories and your set macronutrients, food choices, whatever your diet prescription is, at the end of the day, is the same. I don't care if you fast for 18 hours and eat for 6. I don't care if you eat every 10 minutes and eat a fucking rice cake. Spray it with honey and MTS Nutrition Whey. I don't care if you have an intravenous flow of glucose and whey. I don't care if you like whipped cream off your wife's nipples. I don't care. It doesn't matter. The post-workout nutrient window. Joke. Dr. Tipton himself said it would take years of perfect adherence for it to even make, and I'm paraphrasing here because I'm sure he didn't say this, fuck all of a difference. There's no, no. Oh, why are you screaming, Mark? Because I want to. If you don't like my screaming, watch some quieter channel. Okay, watch a nice, watch some little, you know, tiptoe ballet shit, all right? This is my channel. This is how I talk. You come to my backyard, come to Burlington, North Carolina, train with me, you'll notice that this is how I am year-round. This is how I roll. Well, maybe I'm a little bit extreme in this video, but that's because I'm impassionate. I'm so passionate right now, I have an erection. Check it out, guys. Get nipple erections. Nipple erections. I got rice cake crumbs all over me. All right, ADD aside. It doesn't matter when you eat. Intermittent fasting, if you want to do it, if you find it a better way to live your life, great. If you think you need to eat every two to three hours to get results, you're incorrect. If you think you need to eat three squares a day, you're, okay, you're right. Everything's right. Just make sure at the end of the day it all meets up. And those guys, oh, I missed a meal. No, you didn't. You didn't miss a meal. Just eat more the next meal. Make sure at the end of the day your protein, carbs, and fat. And for you guys who are looking for this magical fucking ratio where all you gain is lean. Van did a video on this on the Bro Fitness channel. There is no magic ratios. Ratios are stupid because as you diet and different people, you get different things you need to do. Right now, my shit's all fucked up. I'm at 550 protein some days, and I'm at 400 grams of carbs and 60 grams of fat. Sometimes though it's 45. That shit ain't following any ratio. That's following a death ratio according to some. Oh, your testosterone. Oh, your balls are going to fall off. My wife's having a kid this week. My balls work too good. My balls work so good I had sex with her and I got her brother pregnant in another state. That's how potent my balls are. Let me tell you this. All y'all looking for the magic ratio ain't gonna happen. All y'all looking for timing, looking for this magical timing, intermittent fasting, and all, and it works. Don't get me wrong. Look at the twins. Twins are all the proof I need that that shit works. I don't need any other proof. I'll just look at those motherfuckers, get a bottle of lotion, look at them some more. And then when I'm done cleaning up, I'll look at them some more. And I'll say, you know what? That intermittent fasting works. Van, he's eating a few times a day. That motherfucker has no body fat on him. Eating frequently works. It all works. Just make sure at the end of the day you get your calories in. And if you're trying to rush in a post-workout shake, I just get hated out on bodybuilding.com. Hated on. Chuck Rudolph and I, my old R&D guy from Salvation, we went on. We had the cut diet, the game over cut diet, and we had no post-workout shake in there. All y'all science motherfuckers who are saying what I'm saying now are like, oh, you need to spike that there insulin. Oh, you need to get this in. You need your fucking dextrose. Da -da 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 -da. Bam! You're wrong, bitch. 
doesn't matter. At the end of the day, I don't care if you don't eat for three hours post-workout. Your body is not that stupid. The only time I feel nutrient timing matters is during workout branch to amino acids. Because I've seen the data. I know you guys are going to say, this, and let me, let me tell you this. Now post it in the comments section on my BCA video. If y'all want to spend $30,000 and fund a study and prove the study I did wrong, that's great. Another thing is, I ain't getting paid jack squat on branch chains anymore. It ain't how I pay my bills. I can sell whey protein. I like branch chains, all right? That's the only time I see meal timing matters. And that's just an uh, intro workout shake. And if you don't do it, you ain't going to lose. I mean, you ain't going to lose out. You're still going to make gains if you train and you diet. Eat the right damn food. Don't matter when you eat it. Don't matter if you do post-workout. And I'm tired of this. I'm tired of this. I'm taking it seriously because it's not a game. This is being shackled to ancient prison stations Risen from a spacious grip Not living as a slave to a force I hate it Shameless artists and product placement Hunting cast and surveillance Running circles around the shapeless Saturated, overpopulated Purpose the same as my interior is vacant Cause I dedicated my entire heart to 